In this video, we are going to solve the question number 10 of exercise 8.1. Now, question number 10 says, in triangle PQR, right angled at Q, PR plus QR is equal to 25 centimeter and PQ is equal to 5 centimeter. Determine the values of sin P, cos P and tan P. So, in this case, we have a right angle triangle. Hai. So, first, we draw the right angle triangle. Ko so, we have a diagram. Hai. We have a triangle PQR which is right angled at Q and we have a PQ ki length hume given hai 5 cm and the two sides hai, that is PR and QR dono ka sum is given to us as 25 cm. So, in this case, we have given kya hai, that PR plus QR is equal to 25 cm. So, what is QR ki value? Kya jati hai? It will be 25 minus PR. अब अगर हम चलते हैं in the triangle PQR, we have angle Q is equal to 90 degree. So, यहां से what I will get is that PR square is equal to PQ square plus QR का square. This is by the Pythagoras theorem. अब PR को हम as it is लिखते हैं, PR square is equal to PQ की value हमारे पास है, that is given to us as 5 centimeter. So, I will write 5 का square plus QR, QR की value हमने लिखी 25 minus PR, so I'll put this as 25 minus PR का whole square, so यहां से I will get PR square is equal to, now 5 का square is 25 plus, now I have 25 minus PR का whole square, so that is A minus B का whole square, that will be A square plus B square minus 2AB, so यहां से 25 का square, that is 625, plus PR ka square minus 2 into 25 that is 50 into PR so 50 PR अब ये जो PR का square है और ये PR square this gets cancelled तो अब यहां से ये जो 50 PR है इसे हम left hand side पे ले जाएंगे I will get 50 PR is equal to 625 plus 25 that is 650 अब ये 0 और 0 cancel हो गया 5 into 1 is 5 5 into 13 is 65. तो यहाँ से PR जो है, it comes out to be 13 centimeter. तो अगर PR 13 centimeter है, हमें पता है that QR is equal to 25 minus PR. तो यहाँ से QR जो है, it comes out to be 25 minus 13. तो QR जो है, it comes out to be 12 centimeter. तो अब हमारे पास QR की length is 12 centimeter and PR की length is 13 centimeter. So now यहाँ पे हमें sin p, cos p और tan p की values निकालनी है. This is angle p over here. So now sin of angle p पहले निकालते हैं. That will be given by perpendicular upon the hypotenuse. So perpendicular अगर देखते हैं हम इस case में, that is the side opposite to the angle. So इस case में opposite side है हमारे पास qr और hypotenuse हमारे पास है pr. So I have qr by pr. Now QR जो है इस केस में that is 12 हमने अभी calculate किया and PR भी हमने निकाला अभी that is 13 in this case. So I have 12 by 13 will be sin P की value. Then उसके बाद अगर हमने cos of P की value निकालनी है that is base upon hypotenuse. तो base अगर हम देखते हैं for angle P that is the side adjacent to it that is QP in this case. So I get PQ by the hypotenuse that is PR. PQ हमें given है question में that is 5 and the hypotenuse in this case is 13. तो हमारे पास cos P की value comes out to be 5 by 13. Then हमें tan P की value निकालनी है. Tan P is given by perpendicular upon base. Perpendicular हमने अभी लिखा that is QR and base is PQ. So QR की value is 12 and PQ की value is 5. So I will get from here that tan P जो है it comes out to be 12 by 5. And these are the three ratios that are required in this particular question. So guys, thanks for watching the video. For any doubt regarding this video or any other topics, you can contact us on email or WhatsApp as shown on the screen. Please like, comment and share this video. For more videos, subscribe to the channel Top Flight Classes and click on the bell icon so you do not miss any updates. Happy learning!